Alright. It's just like before. <laughs> just like Mina Ipsy. <laughs> just hot mess. Hey everyone, this is Natasha from Makeup and SFC. Welcome back to my channel. As you can see, we are in a different location. We are not in my home, we're in Maddie's home. We decided to collab yet again on another video. So, we are going to do some Melt Cosmetics, Dana, Laura inspired looks. So, we don't know what we're going to do yet, we're just going to play with some makeup. So, if you're interested in watching this video, go ahead and keep doing so. Don't forget to like and subscribe not only to my channel, but to Maddie's channel. I'll have everything linked down below or up here. And support us because we're great. <laughs> so, let's get started. I think today I'm gonna do your method and do my eyes first. Okay, I still I don't I have no idea what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, I'm gonna use my Lottie concealer as um, a base. My eyeshadow base. And I'm gonna use my Wet n Wild eyeshadow primer. I haven't used this concealer as a base, but I figured if it holds up pretty good under my eye, I think as a base it. It should work well too. So we're all using all of Maddie's melt stacks. I have the gunmetal and I have rust and like Enigma, but she has all of them. So I'm very excited. I've gotten most, if not all, my stacks during their sales. Yeah. I don't think I've ever paid. really paid full price for. I don't think I have either. <gasps> I had a deja vu just now. Like this was meant to be. <laughs> I had a vision of this way before we are doing this. How weird is that? That's weird. I believe that for sure. So right now I'm taking neon on the crease with my Sephora 10 brush. I still don't know what I'm doing. I'm just gonna see what we end up with. I have a feeling it's gonna end up being like a burgundy. No, don't do it, don't do it. <laughs> <laughs> The problem that I have with these shadows, I'm going to use the pink from the Radioactive Stack, is that they're so like soft. soft. Yeah, they kick up a lot of dust. Oh, we said we were going to do questions, so let's look up oh, some yeah. questions. I got yellow eyeshadow all over my phone. <laughs> I have so many of these. Random brushes? Yeah. Yeah, I know. Me too. I'm and they work better than some of my brand name brushes. So I ordered some brushes from Ooh, tell me more. the Makeup Shop. I didn't want to buy Morphe brushes. Yeah, I'm kind of over my Morphe phase. Would you rather watch Star Wars or Star Trek? Use whichever moves you find most relevant. Moves? What does that mean? I don't know, but I mean Star Wars. Star Wars, hands, hands down. down. <laughs> yeah, I haven't, I'm, I'm not too familiar with Star Trek. All I know is no, like no Spock. Idea. No, I haven't. That's no all idea. I know. I, and I know what their faces look like, and I know, um, what's the actor's name that was in X-Men? I know that he was in Star Trek, but that's pretty much it. The he was in Wonder Woman. Oh no, not, it's not the same guy? The main guy from Wonder Woman? He's in the new revamped Star Trek yeah. movies, but like the original television show oh, I have no is idea. the guy from X-Men. The bald guy. Xavier? Yes, Xavier. Xavier. Yeah, that guy. He was in Beauty and the Beast. Was he? That's what? Cogsworth. Clog, <laughs> we're not talking about the same <laughs> thing. the same person? No, we're like, what sure. What am I talking about? I don't know. Oh, yeah, no. No, that's not him. No, 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 yeah. no. Oh, you know who I'm thinking about? You said X Men, so he. Magneto. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. That Mag he is, yeah, he Ma is hot. yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Magneto. Now we're on the same page. Number two. Read on a Kindle or paperback book? I prefer paper books. There's just like a satisfaction of like getting to the end of your book mm -hmm. or like midway through the book. And putting a bookmark? Yeah. <laughs> like, I don't know. Like, I've read books on like my iPad and stuff like that, but it's just not, it's not the same. And I get tired of looking. I mean, I look at a computer all day long at work. So That's the last true. thing I really want to do if I'm going to be doing something is looking at a book right on like an iPad or screen. I even love older books when they've been in the library for a really long time and they smell. Oh, they have that that smell. That smell. And I really love when the books have gotten wet and they're dry and they have crinkly papers. Oh yeah. That's my favorite 
I don't know why. I used to get my notebooks wet on purpose just so just that, to do that they would have like a, a nice crinkle to them. So I just used radon in my crease. Now we got some kind of like peach ring thing going on. <laughs> you did pink! I know, but I'm gonna add the green one. Okay, okay. I'm gonna do something different. Okay. We're both supposed to do something different. I like what I like. I know, me too. I ended up freaking making orange. Like, this is red. <laughs> you did. But it ended up looking orange. <laughs> Go to a play or a musical? Mm. Are you not a musical person? No, I am. Oh, okay. But I think it depends on what... Like, Aladdin is coming to San Francisco. You know I... Re I missed out on watching The Lion King, but I really want to go watch... You should do it. Aladdin. Yeah. In November. You should do it. I don't really have a preference. Like, I know some people really don't like musicals. I... They don't have a soul. I, I like them. Me too. I'm pretty sure Disney probably has a lot to do with that, though, because... Right. <laughs> All Disney mu movies are basically musicals. So did you like Beauty and the Beast? I did. Did we talk about this already? I don't know, but um, there was only like one song I didn't like. Which, which, which one? Be Your Guest. Yes! I hated that song! You know why? Because I don't like Ewan McGregor. Not that much. Like, when I found out it was him, I was like, oh, that's why I can't stand A lot it. of people didn't like his accent, which... It wasn't good! It was a horrible French accent. But a lot of people were like, oh no, but his wife is French, so he practiced with her. But it was, like I know it's supposed to be an overdramatic French accent, but it was not. I don't know, I feel like if he just copied the original character, he would have been good enough. I mean, I love Moulin Rouge. Moulin Rouge is, I love that movie. I love that movie too. He bugged me in that one too. Really? Yeah. I just, I don't like him singing. <laughs> Can you imagine if he's staying in Star Wars, though? Star Wars is going to be a singing thing? No, but I'm saying, can you imagine if he... Because he's in... Because he's in Star Wars. Oh, yeah. So can you imagine if he's saying... Obi-Wan. Obi-Wan. <laughs> Obi-Wan. I sing. And so when I watch anything with singing, I'm actually the, the meanest critic. And people don't like watching movies with me, especially if they're musicals, telling them that it was horrible. Oh, like everyone loves Wicked. Wicked? Wicked. So everybody saw Wicked and completely loved that girl. <laughs> What's her name? Oh, um. That poor woman. <laughs> the poor woman that John Travolta butchered. Totally butchered her name. And now I can't remember what her real name is. Idina, Idina Manzanas. <laughs> <laughs> because I want to call her Indina Manzanas or something. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, that poor lady. And her singing voice just got messed up. I can't stop thinking about John Travolta. Man, oh, and I recently so watched funny. Grease. He was such a fox in Grease. I liked young John Travolta. Totally. Like Grease, Saturday. Saturday Night Fever. Fever? Yeah. I'm basically just using Xenon and the pink from the radioactive sack. I used a little bit of Enigma to darken up the outer crease, mm -hmm. like mm -hmm. kind of like a halo, and then I just add a little bit more pink. Hike or bike? Neither. <laughs> <laughs> because we're inactive people. <laughs> I mean, if I, if I had to, if I had to hike, I guess I'm scared of being on a bicycle. We had bought bikes, and then. I went, I used my bike like three times and I basically I panicked every time we went on a ride. Oh no. Thought I was gonna get like ran over by a car. <sighs> it's just not my thing. Not safe. No. Not my thing. I think I would bike for me because I'm shorter than the average. I when we stop, you have to put your feet on the ground and I can't do that if I'm oh. up on a bike. So that's the only thing that makes me scared about riding with real people. Because with real people? <laughs> with real people in real cars. <laughs> Maybe if I was like on a bike trail where there are no cars. That's a good idea, yeah. I would be totally okay with that. But no. out in the streets? No. Not out in these streets? No, thank you. I'm like hitting a wall. I don't know what I want to do next. Have a margarita or a piña colada? Um, I'm all about piña coladas. Mm -hmm. They're my jam. Mainly because... It's more like a um, smoothie. So my favorite all-time piña colada ever is the raspberry one from Disneyland, the Coke bar. Mm. Oh, 
I have had that. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was a good one. I want to go to Disneyland. To Disneyland. Okay, we got some like fire going on right now. This is cool. So I'm using, uh, this is actually one of the eyeshadows I was going to get as a single. Emily on the lid, wetened on this brush. This kind of reminds me of um, the Pokemon, the fiery Pokemon. The, fire Pokemon. the fox. Oh, the Ninetales? Yeah. Is that what its name is, Ninetales? I think when it um, grows up. I'm trying to think if I should add a wing to this or no wing. I know. I feel like I should do a wing because I never do wings. Crash with friends or stay in a hotel? Whenever we go to LA or we have an event where we go somewhere, like we stay together mm -hmm. in a hotel, which makes it fun. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Sometimes I like the hotel because they turn over your room. We've been doing a lot of Airbnb lately, and that's nice too because it's like your own space, nobody bothers you, but then like you have to take care of the things. Like Oh, like you have to clean? Yeah. I savor the moments when I can flush the toilet paper in the toilet. <laughs> oh. <laughs> or, or like... I can let my hair go in the drain because it's not my drain. Like you can use as much water as you want because you know. Technically we should still be conserving, but like <laughs> it's not my bill and not my water. Exactly. Like when we went to <laughs> Disneyland, we stayed at a hotel. So I was exhausted. So I took the longest shower just to like <sighs> decompress. Decompress. Yeah. Okay, we both like this primer. Good oh, choice. Oh yeah, I brought it with me too. Good choice. So doesn't it smell like a face mask to you? A little bit. It reminds me of like a Korean face mask. So I'm using my Milani Make It Last Prime Correct and Set. We didn't even say the name. No problem. No problem. Primer by to Touch and Soul. Touch and Soul. I don't know why I wanted to say it in French. <laughs> touche. 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 I don't know why. Smooth and pore covering. Top secret for perfect makeup. I think the day we went into the store, because I remember seeing it, they emailed us like, this is the new primer, blah, blah, blah. And then now, every video that I've seen on my feed, like, yeah, has it. I d <laughs> We're so cool. I know, I'm calling you. <laughs> so I'm going to use my obsession lately. This is the Kevin Aquans Sensual Skin Enhancer. Uh, this shit is bomb. But this is really if you don't want to look like you were wearing makeup. Like, I'm mean, this little dot right here is all I'm gonna use. What color are you using? SX11. Oh. Little. It's like really yellow. But it mellows out. I don't know. I think like in person it looks so good. I've been wearing this and not foundation. And I don't even care because if my skin's peeking through I kind of like it. Yeah. I've just been digging a lighter base recently because it's so freaking hot sometimes I too. I still have to do my like sweat proof um, makeup routine. Ooh, what because... are your suggestions? So, I'll have to and the reason the, I know, right? <laughs> Stay tuned. <laughs> the reason why I figured that that would be my routine is because I wore it at Disneyland and my makeup, like my concealer, was creaseless. It, it looked as if I had just put it on, so. That um, so I use a little bit of my Marc Jacobs. What is this? Oh, the do, do you the do you drops? But it's like do you question mark? <laughs> and I feel so lucky that I didn't have to pay for this. I know. Thank you, influencer. I got that one too. And I think this this concealer or the skin enhancer is just it's better with your fingers. Oh, so you're not using foundation? Nope. I am. I'm gonna use the Jordana Complete Cover Two in One. Concealer foundation, but just a little bit. Um, just a little bit on my beauty blender. I use like the smallest amount of foundation though, yeah. because it is a total coverage foundation. I don't really need a lot, and I have freckles that I still like them to peek through. I'm gonna set my face with my Maybelline Shine Free Loose Powder. It's really really nice. Look at that! Like it's no pores. Like, we look baby butt smooth right now. I love that primer. I know. It's so good. I hope they keep it cheap forever. Oh, yeah. Only $18. Yeah. At Sephora. Oh, man. And I forgot to highlight, too. Well, I'm going to use my Sony Cashew stick. Oh, I should set the rest of my face. I'm going to be using the Too Faced Primed and Poreless Translucent Powder. 
I was gonna bring that contour oh. kit. But this is my old Anastasia one. Oh, signed, kind of? Yeah, this was signed by Anastasia back in the day. So I'm gonna use the Stargazer highlight from Melt. Ooh, ooh, I want to highlight. Ooh, ooh, me too. I'm getting there. I'm just almost done. I'm using gold and ore. Oh, there it is. Oh, wow. Yeah. A, you were just saying that. Can Perf you only use one? I mainly just use this one. Oh, my God, Maddie. <laughs> Maddie, like, I'll just, like, swirl my brush in there. <laughs> Maddie has one of, like, the best collections. Like, she has a little bit of everything. One of my brows wants to be straight. One of my eyebrows wants to have an arch, and yeah. um, I have no idea how to correct it. Skiing or snowshoeing? Skiing sounds faster. What's snowshoe? Oh, snowshoeing. So what walking. You, you like? Yeah. Okay. I skiing. I guess I would like to know learn how to snowboard though. Yeah, I think that should be one of our trips to go to the snow. I'm into the snow and forever. I really want to go to Denver, but my fear is that I will get snowed in because I got snowed in as a child and I remember missing school and I was like, no. Travel by plane, train, or automobile. I think it depends where you're going. I actually don't enjoy the plane. I enjoy the convenience, but I don't like the actual trip because I have really bad sinus pressure sometimes. Oh, yeah. And it like cuts my ear inside my brain and makes me want to rip out anybody's limbs who are next to me. Like uh, the first time I flew in a plane after a, a long break, I was in tears. I was holding Mike's hand and I was like, I've sat with you on a plane, remember? Oh my God! Yes, that's right. It was really bad. It was so bad. I felt so bad for you. It's hard. Landing yeah. is just the worst. Yeah, yeah, that was bad. I, I tried. Tried so hard not to throw up. Oh, <laughs> that was a whole nother issue. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank God it happened at the end, so I threw up on the plane. Fun fact. Um, we're good thing really you were good friends. Good now. thing you were sitting by the, the window <laughs> next to me. <laughs> and they have those bags, I right? I know. Those vomit bags. That was provided. Good looking out, virgin. Yeah. <laughs> what a hot mess. <laughs> oh, good choice. Yes. I, love that. I think I'm gonna go grab a different color. I'll be right back. Come back. Come back. All by myself. <laughs> I know when to talk to. <laughs> Okay. So I'm going to do a pink lip. Oh yeah, yeah. This is Jeffree Star Masochist. What is this nonsense? I got like caca on my pants. And, oh, it's chocolate ice cream. <laughs> when did you have chocolate ice cream? Yesterday. <laughs> oh, and I was—I thought I was doing so good. I went to the movies, and I rarely eat ice cream because I don't like to eat food like that in the dark. Uh -huh. That what did you have dibs? No, it was like a dryer's. It was just a scoop. A scoop of ice cream. What did you watch? Wonder Woman again. Oh. <laughs> My aunt hadn't seen it yet. She's like, you want to get over? Okay. I love that movie. I thought it was really good. It was really good. I enjoyed it. Go to a comedy club or a dance club? I think I'd rather go to a comedy club. Mm -hmm. Have a couple drinks. Sometimes I have my moments where I'm like, yeah, I want to go to a bar and I want to go out and go to the club. That's what usually happens is I'll go out and then I regret my decisions and then pay for it the next day. I can only remember three instances of me being like dead ass hungover. Yeah, yeah. I've had some good ones. I had a house party once. In this house? Yeah, in this house. Whoa, this is like a good house party house. Back when I was like, I don't know, like 18, which you should not do. <laughs> Where were your parents? I don't know, like on vacation or something. That's pretty ballsy. Of I you. know. No, it was bad. Like the cops came, everything. I do not condone underage drinking, but you live and you learn. 
after that, I never wanted to drink ever again. Oh. Ever again. <laughs> what did you drink? <laughs> 151. Oh my it was, gosh. It was bad. Yeah. That's like lighter fluid. It's disgusting. It's disgusting. My problem is, is that I don't do it often enough to know what my limit is. And then so when I do go hard, I go hard. And it'll usually be like after about of maybe, I don't know, six or seven months of not doing it. No. Oh. And then I'll be like, woo! And then, oh. You're like, that was a mistake. <laughs> Oh, I like these. There's something about creme lashes that, I mean, do we see the elevation of this look right now with these lashes? Difference. Yeah, we just Huge. leveled up. Leveled up. And I learned this from Desi, but like if you don't wear eyeliner and then you put them on really close to your lash line, you fold your lid over it and then it makes it look like you don't have them on. Oh my god. It looks so good. Thanks, Desi. I think we've learned a lot about each other. Like we didn't know already. Oh, swim in a pool or the ocean? I'm kind of scared of the ocean. I'm terrified of the ocean. Yeah. So, open water is just really scary. I used to watch those uh, documentaries. I don't know if Oprah was the one who narrated them, but we don't know what's really in the ocean. We only know a certain percentage of what actual wildlife is in the ocean. And they are discovering new fish like every day. And all the fish that live in like the deep, deep, deep darkness. Those are some creepy ass fish. Oh my God, they look terrifying. Like when Finding Nemo had that, <laughs> that big, what, yeah. what animal was that? I don't know, but that. The one that like ate them. I hate putting on lip products on my channel. I'll usually cut it out because my eye, I have a lazy eye, and so when I look down, one of them is, one of my eyes <laughs> <laughs> gets like wonky. It's like one of my eyes, one of mine goes like in, like it'll, it'll be in, I don't know. Uh -huh. It's weird. I feel you, girl. Super Stay Matte Ink. Breaking the seal. I think that'll look nice. Am I, am I doing it backwards? Oh no, there is no front. I only swatched it and I thought it was gonna be like a gloss, but it, oh. it dries. It's weird. Hold on, let's see what's gonna happen here. Oh, it's like not orange. I thought it was going to be orange. That's okay, it kinda goes. I kinda like it. It's good though. It looks like a like a padded in lip. You know? It looks good though. I like that. But look, it sticks. <laughs> is it completely dry though? I think so. Good luck taking it off though. <gasps> no, is it one of those? Look, that's from yesterday. No. <laughs> that little swatch right there. You played me. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I have a, I have my e.l.f. Um, liquid lipstick remover, mm -hmm. but... Did I have a little pepper in my teeth the whole time we were filled? <laughs> All right, so I think we're done, right? I think it's as good as it's gonna get. So, I think I kinda like that on the pony thing. Sorry, I'm I know, gonna... my little chongo. I didn't even try today with my hair. It just was not going to happen. Oh. <laughs> well, thank you so much to Maddie for letting me film here and for being my friend in this video because I think we had a good time getting to know each other. Because we don't know, I know each other. Because we don't. We haven't known each other for like... How many years is it now? A bajillion years. No, like three? Two or three? Yeah. Because it's like as old as our channels. That's when we started. Yeah, like friends. three years. Oh, I love filming with you. This is fun. Thank you so much. Alrighty. All right, we're going to take our shots. We'll maybe do some like extra slow-mos. Should we do some of those? Like typical like, like beauty. Like over the shoulder. Oh. Do you ever do those? I know, actually, it's kind of like hairspray too because it like makes oh, my. Well, I got some since we have the fan <laughs> going on. These are the finished looks. I hope you like. Don't forget to like and subscribe to both of us. I'll link everything down below. I don't know, we'll try to maybe put what we used, but for sure we'll put melt. It's all melt, at least on the eyes for the both of us. Yeah. It was all melt. 
and they're so good if you ever want to buy eyeshadows these are really good quality they're pricey they're about like 48 to 50 depending on which stack you get but they're so good the pans are gigantic oh <gasps> we should do that oh for the picture. for the thumbnail the we thumbnail. can do like one in one yeah yes okay i'm gonna take our thumbnails oh, okay thank you for watching bye